Alright, hey guys, it's Sean here. It's really windy out today, um, but I'm doing a range test on my WPS. Um, I've got one cue left, and I'm just about 2,500 feet away. Uh, 2,459, I think it is, what it measured out to be. So, we're going to go ahead and give this a try. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it, but we're going to give her a whirl. There it is. <laughs> All right, cool. So I'm gonna walk back another half mile. And, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna tell you my thoughts on the WPS as I walk. Again, I hope you guys can hear me. It's pretty windy, but uh, I'm really impressed. This 915 megahertz has excellent penetration, um, and if you can see out there, there's a slight hill. Um, I'm actually behind that. Now when I was walking up here and I was over in that direction over there, um, I was pressing the button over the hill, through the trees, all the... Hold on a second here. Try to get out of the wind a little bit. Um, I was popping off cues. So I'm really impressed. Um, mesh technology? <laughs> it's not really needed. So um, I don't know what else I can say uh, right now, but... Uh, um, I really think it's a contender, guys. I really think it's something that uh, the backyard guys alike, uh, enthusiasts, should really look into. Cost per cue on these things is pretty fantastic, especially when you get up into the Pro Mods where they're 144 cues each. So, anyway, I'm gonna go. Talk to you later. Bye.